How's it going, guys? Uh, today I'm going to give you some tips on how to keep your uh, gun safes dry or your ammo boxes. Um, a lot of us use these uh, dehydrator um, boxes, so uh, these humidifier boxes, which are basically composed of silicon gel uh, beads in a bag. Um, now these, yes, you can reuse them. Um, I just uh, reactivated mine in the oven the other day. Um, in the oven for uh, about five to six hours at 325 degrees. Um, so this is a good way to keep them dry, but um, my tip is to reuse these packs. Um, now I'm going to show you a way to uh, make them more uh, easily uh, reactivated and also kind of more convenient than all of these um, pouches laying around. So uh, I have a, a bunch of these I've accumulated. Um, so I had about 50 so, uh, 50 or so um, that I was reusing, and uh, some of them actually have begun to um, get discolored and burnt because of being reused so many times. Um, these packages actually aren't made to be in the oven. Um, they're not quite as durable as the bag um, that comes in these dehydrator boxes. So what I'm going to show you um, is basically consisting of making your own um, reusable container for these silicon gel beads. And what I'm going to do is uh, basically um, scoop, so scoop the beads in the jar, and then you're going to use uh, coffee filters. Um, so a one or two coffee filters on top, and then resealing it. Um, to give you your container, and this is perfect to put in the oven also. You just take the, the um, coffee filter off, and then you can put it in the oven with your um, other um, dehydrator bags. So I'm going to go ahead and do this quickly. So there it is, full to the top. Yeah, there's a couple particles in there and some beads that are discolored uh, from getting overheated um, in the oven at certain times. I accidentally had them cl too close to the, um, the bottom burner, uh, but no biggie, just a couple burnt ones in there. So now I'm going to put the coffee filter on top. I'm going to use one. You can use more if you want to, but I don't foresee this being banged around too much, so it doesn't really need to be extremely durable. And it eats a little bit bulky if you're going to put it in an ammo box, um, but you know, some people actually use larger metal containers than that. Um, so it's pretty good size, um, not too big. You could use whatever jar size you want. That's um, a useful little trick to re, uh, reuse and repurpose silicon gel packets. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you found this video somewhat useful. Um, stay strong and I'll catch you later.